American storage hunter and television personality Daryl Sheets was born on the 13th of May, 1958 in San Diego, California, and rose to prominence as the main star of the reality television series Storage Wars. First aired in 2010 and on the A&E Network, and continuing to the present day. The show and Daryl's activities in bidding at the auctions are the main sources of his net worth. Daryl Sheets has been active in business since the 80s and in the entertainment industry since the debut on TV. How much is Daryl Sheets' net worth? It's estimated by Celebrity.Money that the total size of his wealth is as much as $5 million, accumulated by receiving a significant income from the A&E network, as well as adding considerable sums from his findings in storage lockers, which have contained such items as rare collections of comics, a letter written by Abraham Lincoln, and even several paintings by Pablo Picasso. Daryl was raised in San Diego County, but currently lives in North Hollywood. He became interested in the contents of abandoned storage lockers and containers in his 20s and has consistently made money from them over the 30 plus years since, which saw him invited to take part in the TV program Storage Wars in 2010. In fact, Daryl Sheets debuted as the main star of the series, which has become a significant source of his net worth. The very idea behind the reality series is to portray people who make a profit buying the abandoned contents of storage lockers and selling them, and selling the items for considerably more. It should be noted that in California, storage lockers are hired for only three months, and then, if the rent is not paid, the contents are sold at an auction. The locker contents are sold in one piece, and the buyers may have just a quick look in from the open door. The main buyers on the show are Daryl Sheets, his son Brandon, Gerald Schultz, and Brandy Passante, nicknamed the Young Guns, Dave Hester, the Mogul, Ivy Calvin, the King, Renee and Cassie Nezhudo, the Bargain Hunters, as well as Mary Padilla, the Junkster. Daryl Sheets is a very popular personality of the show as the viewers apparently love his sharp tongue, especially when he becomes emotional while bidding. Because of those character features, his nickname is The Gambler. His fans know well his saying, this is the wow factor, and are entertained by his occasional malaprisms, incorrect word in place of a word with a similar sound. One of the bombshells of the show was Daryl's largest bid of $3,600 for one locker, the contents of which were later valued at more than $300,000 because of the stunning finds in it, the artworks of Frank Gutierrez. Sheets has his own personal website, effectively an online store on which he sells items he purchased in the show's auctions, and which is managed by his wife. The Storage Wars show has high ratings, as in the very beginning it was watched by over 2 million viewers, and by the third season it reached more than 5. Concerning his private life, Sheets is not very open and prefers to keep it to himself. He is not one who posts his private life facts on social networking sites. Due to this, it has been rumored that he is gay. However, he is known to have been married twice. Sheets has two children from his first marriage and two stepchildren in his second marriage with his wife and business partner, Kimber. 